Hello, everybody. Welcome to a live reaction stream from MinMax. From next is a place about games, friends, and getting better. My name is Ben Hansen. Thank you for being here. I'm joined by Sarah Podorsky, who's in the zone today, folks. That's music, man. That's right. Always just gets makes my me love hype. video games. Honestly, sometimes this is. We should set this as our alarm clock. So we just get excited, just spring up out of bed like "Don't Wake Daddy." Uh, we're also joined by Leo, the daddy who likes to be woken himself. Vader. Leo, state of play, more like state of emergency. I gotta watch this thing. <laughs> to the point that Leo might get so excited, he might need to just sprint around his house, and that's why he's on the roaming cam, I think is the idea. <laughs> yeah, I could head outdoors, yeah. That's I don't know right. where the stream's gonna take me. That's right, when you have to go outside and scream, Siphon Filter VR, just to let your neighbors know. We're, we wanna capture that in this moment, so that's why we're here for, for you today. Uh, hey, uh, Minmax, you might know it, you might not. Uh, you could help support it, in a big way. Look, there's there's a lot of things you can do if you're interested in such a thing before we dive into the state of play. You can hit subscribe on the YouTube channel. One click, not a big deal for you, big deal for us. We'd appreciate that. Uh, and then also the thing is, you see this cat here, it reminds me. Um, we are under 100 new supporters on Patreon away from hitting our goal of 3,400 supporters where we're gonna be creating a documentary about the pets of VinMax. Everybody's pets. We're gonna be highlighting in a I would dare say cute little documentary that I think would be really fun to produce. And we're gonna produce that if we hit 3,400 supporters. Right now, yeah, we are about 90 new supporters away. So you can jump in at that $2 tier. And if you jump in, you can also join the deepest dive on Like a Dragon Ishan. Uh, Leo and Sarah and Jacob Geller and Michael Hyam are on that thing. So help create the best, most thorough discussion about Like a Dragon Ishan on the internet and help support the game club uh, format in general. Okay, I filibustered enough. Sarah, you in the zone, you ready? I'm ready. All right, here we Hit go. Hit me with those games. Please, dear God, we need games. Uh, everybody in chat, let us know what the volume is, uh, as always. We can make Leo's cat louder, quieter, whatever y'all need. Um, can you make Leo's cat bigger? Yeah, I think that's can enough. Can you put it over this? <laughs> Whew. Uh, people are wondering, Sarah, if your digital horses count as pets for the documentary? No. Okay. I do think a, a goal at some point that'd be fun. I don't know if it's New Show Plus or what, but we should ride real horses at some point at Min Max. I think that'd be really fun. Welcome to our first state of play. Even though you have, I thought you had a few horses. You've got a lot to show, um, including. Yeah, I'm, I'm scared of them from my childhood, but I've ridden them as an adult, and I think the they're cool. League. But first, okay. PlayStation VR 2 is finally here. Let's dive right in with a look at five games arriving on PlayStation VR Foglands. 2 this year. Uh, by the way, we're going to be talking about this in the new episode of the Min Max Show podcast, which is, we're going live right after this, but it'll be in your podcast feed after that. That's what the volume is, everybody. Kid, we gotta work on your focus. Distractions. Jim? Jim? Jim. You'll get you killed out there. Remember what we shook on. I like the art. Or, I guess yeah. we'll just have to keep this up. Card base? Artsy cards? Card base VR? No, no, no! With gun? Behind the course. Let's try again, shall we? <laughs> okay. Are there cards? <laughs> Do you think you, you, throw, you throw them? Finally. It could just maybe be like a card system card. that defines your, your run. Right. Like hand of fate. Neon white. That was a misdirect. Whatever the song is, I know it'll nuke us on YouTube, so I look forward to it. <laughs> as long as you rap a different verse over it, we'll be fine. <laughs> what rhymes with fog? Okay. So that's one of the five new VR games they're showing off. Run, Leo, run! Leo's going through his I've own jungle. I've gotta get to the virtual world. <laughs> Bitten by an alligator VR. This looks far cryish. Yep. Look out! Freak boy's getting away! I 
I don't want to hear that on a walkie-talkie ever. I want to do like fun things in VR. I don't want to like <laughs> this is. I don't want to just like. Why are we just suffering unnecessarily right. in the jungle? Normal games scare me in VR. We don't need to make them scary. Right. I want to like All live like a princess in VR, not get attacked by wild animals. Is that too much to ask? <laughs> It just have some lady struggle to build a fire. <laughs> Here we go. Finally, a little bang bang in our VR. Weird color scheme. All right, it's going for an angle. What is going on with their helmets? You think there's some demonic influence there? God, I hope not, Leo. I pray. All right. This is a larger take for PSVR, but it's like, yeah, these, these seem cool. I don't know. If these came out and they got a 975, I still think people are like, well, now I got to buy PSVR 2, you know? But you think there is a possible game that would do that? And uh, these aren't it? Half-Life Alex. Yeah. Which is weird to say. Just, you can already play it elsewhere, but... This may be hard to hear. The Empire will fall. <laughs> Don't open your trailer with that. No one cares. <laughs> People really overassume how much I care about the various empires. <laughs> Unless it's an age of, I don't want to hear it. We can't stop it. But there is a plan to save humanity. Okay, that's it. That's something. Yeah. And now, um, so, is this tied into the show? Because isn't there like an Apple show based on the foundation? Or help us to no. reach foundation. Journey to. All right. In autumn. What a nice way to say fall. How do it people is, make those? How do they pick? You know, do they, are we say falling or are we saying autumn? Yeah. We should all just get rid of fall forever. That's where I'm taking. You. Except for saying fall back for the clock. So that's helpful. Isn't this your game, Ben? To be judged. I don't want to mention it, or I'm going to start crying, sir. You're He's already life. crying. I can see it. You're going to no, show I'm not. It to me. Yeah, before your eyes. That that seems cool. Just think back. Um, to play in VR. I would I would play this again in VR. First thing that you can remember. Yeah, because so VR2 has that, every time you blink, has that tracking inside the headset, right? Yeah, it knows when you yeah. blink. It knows if you've been naughty. Uh, yeah, I forget, um, what, 2021 this came out? It was high on our 210s. I want to say top five? You, it, it's Chloe, your neighbor. The only way to fight against time is to create a work of genius. Which might live on after then again, the Sarah streamed it and said this is for babies. And uh, it's the first time I think you've I only ever you farted that. into the microphone your for your review, if I do recall. <laughs> Keep them closed. It's only a matter of time. I said, good luck trying to emotionally manipulate me. <laughs> <laughs> Something so but imagine if you had a big clunky blurry thing on your head. Wouldn't you get more emotionally yeah. manipulated then? Imagine if I couldn't look away to quickly wipe the tears out of my eyes so no one would see now, them. The next time that you blink. I'm gonna send you back. The game Just rules. You should find some way to play it. I don't know if VR2 is gonna be the way to go, but it's definitely cool to play. Yeah. That was a sneak peek at some great upcoming games. I didn't really like it, but that's because I couldn't like it because other people liked it. Right, 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 right. So I decided not to like it. Yeah, I get it, man. Destiny 2 Lightfall, which launches on PS5 next week. Wow. Man, I have been out of the loop on Destiny. That's next week. Oh yeah, Bungie, you know, the that? PlayStation Studio. Got to get used to that. The witness. The malefactor of our first collapse is at our doorstep. You have no purpose. Purpose. Be 
because you fear to seek one. Leo, I, I'm i imagining a world where... Oh, that looks awesome. Is your failure. I like... I'd like to live in that world. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm imagining a world, yeah, with some sort of cauliflower liquid head guy. Um, no, where, where you got really into Destiny. I want to live in that world, too. Is it possible? I had a brief love affair with it, and I tried to get back into it not long ago. Yeah. I didn't remember you? Not all of us have lives to spare. No. It looks more and more like Warhammer. Or not Warhammer. Um, what's that other game? Launch PS4. Popular. Warframe. Warframe. Yeah. Mm. Looks more and more like Warframe every time I see it. I feel like maybe it's just this expansion's art. I played a lot of Warframe. Really? Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> is this music? Uh, I feel like we're not even looking at games anymore. We're just looking at people who edit video game trailers. Like, it's just like, look, it's like a video game editing trailer showcase. Right, right. Well, I think, um, God, that logo kills me. It's just the Lightyear logo. They can't do that. <laughs> they just can't do it. Oh. They're... Unless he's in it. Oh, don't tease. Chia! No. I, uh, Sarah, I forget, did you play the demo for this? No. It, it might be very good, everybody. Like, it's, I'm really optimistic about it. It doesn't sound like perfect optimism, but we'll take it. It is. I mean, it has it has cool systems. It system. might be really good. It, it has cool systems in it. It's one of those things of like, if they if they play their cards right and the overall mm -hmm. thing can bear the weight of these systems, like, this could be awesome. Yeah, it's got kind of a mimic thing from yeah. Prey, right? Yeah, exactly, yeah. That's really it's like interesting. Wind Waker prop hunt. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> that's the easiest way to describe it. I'm guessing we're getting a release date here. I want to be a dolphin. They are pretty cool. I just don't want it to get a little too video gamey. I'm a little worried that they're gonna like stray it a little bit. What, what is what is video gaming? Where like they're gonna to be like here's and there's a stealth section and then we have to hit. You have to knock out all these guards. <laughs> yeah, stop right. Pollution. Like that's kind of what I like. I just kind of want like a chill. Vibey experience with yep. like some, Chia is one of our most you know, like games. gameplay. But I don't, don't, the don't, don't stray Plus this. Oh, interesting. E Speaking of PlayStation Plus, let's take a it's look weird at what's when they, in store next month. The basically AI narrator says that's one of our most anticipated games. Like, who are you? Who's saying that? I, <laughs> PlayStation? What, what does that mean? You can just say know. stuff. You can just say <laughs> stuff. Like, nobody will call you on it. Like, I still don't understand. Any of the PlayStation Plus things. There's three tiers. That's never have, never will, and they keep changing it. Well, look, Sarah, if you want to play Legend of Dragoon, you got to learn to understand it. We will. You Thank you. Gotta get down, Sarah. The next game is from Enhance, the creators of Tetris. Ooh, here we go. Mark McDonald, Sarah. Yeah. <laughs> What a oh, hoot. I, w I, I want to be a dog. Oh, this is that humanity game? Okay. They already showed this. Right. That looks awesome. Oh my God. I want to lead the people yes. to the rapture. <laughs> I want to rapture people as a oh. dog. What the oh hell? Oh my God. Like Echo Chrome? What are we working with here? It looks like you have to like collect bodies to get across the level, but you have to like keep them from falling off the platforms. This is what I want. This is what I want from games. We have to shepherd this humanity cool. as a dog. They finally made Mario 128 into a game. <laughs> Leo, come on, man. Don't run out of the house. Don't run out of the house. Stay with us. Stay with us. Oh, my God. What the hell? Whoa, war. This is way more Star Wars than I thought. 
we're tackling the big topics in this one. <laughs> I I had the impression this is really weird. I had the impression that Enhanced Games was just like publishing this, but are they actually developing it? Did I misunderstand that? Optional PSVR 2. I'll take it. Yeah. What the hell? This feels like you were just mess you were like messing around in Unity. Right. And you just spawned in a bunch of people and started like <laughs> flinging their bodies around, and you were like, you know what? I think we got a game here. I put a dog in it. <laughs> Slap on a seller. plastic lunchbox. All right. <laughs> Having the level creator really shows a lot of confidence in the mechanics. Mm hmm. Did they say demo today? I think so. They should have made a big deal out of that. They should have spelled it out with the humans. Yeah, they should have. This thing. That's not We Are I feel OFK. Like I've seen a lot of this. It, has it been a while? I think in my mind I connected so it with that We Are OFK the game. President's speech at the assembly. In light of the whole space rock potential like demise a bit. of civilization thing, my chosen thing feels off. What Volcano thing? High. Thank you, Chad. Using this year to um, make an impact. Yeah, perfect. Go with that. Are you okay? Ish. You've come into this year kind of intense with the band stuff. The band. Am I allowed on the internet yeah. these days to not like the look of these characters and not want to have sex with them? Is that leave? allowed or? Well, like, I was just see, I was just thinking like, am, if I was it a dinosaur is. humanoid, Jeez. what dinosaur humanoid would I be? Right. You feel like an ankylosaurus, if I may be so bold. I don't even know what that looks like. <laughs> don't Google it. Don't Google it. I'm googling it. No, 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 no. You bitch. You son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird how everyone's acting. Like uh, I guess if you don't want to take it as a compliment. But to me, everything feels different now. We've always done what you wanted to do. And when dinosaurs fine. kiss, do they but kiss like this? Or do they kiss like this? So if this game doesn't left. tell us that, how I'm going to be freaking outraged. I think Hanson since this is a high school, you kind of got a free out. Oh, as in like I'm as not, far as being attracted to them. Yeah, if they were if they were cool adults, beautiful people, then I'd be really into it. <laughs> I think that's really. They smart. had full time jobs and paid taxes. <laughs> you know things oh, that make man. you sexy. Oh, what are these words? Go. What were those words? <laughs> Ultimate Ninja Storm me. Connections. Oh, now here we go. Just cut you off completely. I'll inherit my master's will. You can't I, I like saying that phrase every no once in a while just to remind yourself of I what life is like. Love you. The Hokage is the person who walks in front of everyone and bears all the pain. Sarah, you down with Naruto? Uh, why are you so yeah, obsessed? I watched <laughs> Up Until Shikunde. Because we're friends. Shikunden is when I stopped. Wow. And it's good? <laughs> The first couple seasons are pretty good. I feel like there's just been... I, I fell feel, off of it. I think it's kind of become a joke as somebody who hasn't watched it, but I feel like it's kind of... The meme factor of Naruto has risen, whereas people being like, no, actually, One Piece is really good. And, like, actually, um, what's the other X-Men high school game that people... or anime that people like? My Hero Academia. Yeah, My Hero Academia. I feel like there's enough animated people like, no, those actually really, you should really watch them. I don't, I don't hear people making the case for Naruto in the last five years, you know? That's because we've already watched it. Maybe that's it. <laughs> I need constant reminders in my life of what's good, though. <laughs> oh, Naruto, it, the show's over? Is that the difference? Naruto's, like, wrapped up. It's like they finished it, and now they're on, like, Boruto, which is his son, and it's, like, not as good. It's okay. It's pretty, yeah, rough. They're all, like, married and don't love their wives enough. What you describe is nothing more than oppression through force. Do you think if they named him Naruto Jr., people would like it more? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> That's kind of what Boruto was, though. Yeah, but they blew it in the branding. Better localization though. Yeah. Just yeah. called it Naruto Jr. They should have just called it Naruto the, the second. In our next two games. And that's what naming a child really is. That it's was just a branding. long trailer. That was. We had a whole Naruto anime discussion in the middle of it. Oh. Oh, here you go, Sarah. Finally. I'll tell you a story, true soul. My life was Finally, some some quality content. Yeah, this is a cool one to have in there. And when I tried to buy it back, it cost me everything. I must finish what I started. Death's design will be complete. 
Discover Gatherick's secret. Necromancy? It is that makes him invincible so we can strip him of his advantage. Whoa. Is there local co op in this one, Sarah? Do you know? I don't know. Seems tough with that camera. You're a pawn, a slave to forces you cannot comprehend. Ooh. Catherick is a frightening man, but you have something he doesn't. <laughs> Allies Dance worth moves. having. Together. What the hell? <laughs> what was that? Yeah, you can like you can like knock people off of things to get fall damage. That looks great. I like they have so much variety. Oh wait, oh, was that co-op that they were showing there? I couldn't tell if they were trying to show off the range of like the gameplay and the combat, or they just that was actually just co-op gameplay. Bow before the absolute. Bow. I love how like unabashedly nerdy this looks. Yes, totally. Incredibly nerdy. Like it's not nearly as like clean and like cool as like the Destiny trailer. Right. They're like, nah, we're like we're playing D and D, we're rolling the dice. It's like a sincere thing of like, who out Welcome there likes elves? Winter. You know, it's like, yeah, you know what? Yeah, yeah, there are some people out there. <laughs> friends it's all set in Evanor, a gorgeous but fallen world you'll control the chaos through wayfinders meet senja who likes to get up close and personal <laughs> in her and favorite Silent, bikini who fights with both firepower <laughs> and fast reflexes this looks like one of those fake games they play the on tv during commercials you know, because right. they're not allowed to play, like, real games, so they have Put to put on, like, really gamey-looking fake like games. Social hub. That's yeah. what that looked like. Turn your loot into new weapons and wayfinders. It kind well, of... I've always wanted to play one of those. Called That's right. Zones. It looks like, was it Paladins? And there's that it does, Battle yeah. Royale game that I actually liked. I forget the name of it, though. That was, like, the Paladins well, offshoot? Am I remembering this correctly? To complete quests, collect loot, and hunt bosses like this Titan. Yes. <laughs> Sorry for not being helpful today. <laughs> no, you're good, man. You're good. So I'm excited life. to bring Wayfinders Beta exclusively to PlayStation, and you can sign up for the chance to play early now. Thanks for Realm watching. Royale. Yes, thank you, Tony Stein. Mwah. Tony. Hey, Tony. Realm Royale. I bet that lasted longer than Rumbleverse did. <laughs> it did. It truly did. We've got big updates on two highly anticipated Capcom games, starting with the debut of three new characters for Street Fighter VI. Three? I don't like the way these are moving. What the shapes? Want? Yeah. Hmm. You wanted them to be little people? I don't know. We had to stare at it for a long time, though. Kronk. Are they adding Kronk to this game? Kronk's this one? I don't know if they need to do three new characters. It's, you got Zangief? That's great. That's going to bring in a certain crowd, and you can move on. You can save the rest. God, he's a big guy, ain't he? <laughs> that he is. <laughs> it looks good. This game looks good. Yeah. Yeah. If only they would just release it. Yeah. Yeah, like, we got eight more trailers for you in the back. Hold on. I just want to see more of that single-player mode more than anything. It's like, I assume all of our old favorites yeah. are in here, but I want to see... I want, yeah, you mean you want to see some of that open-ish open, open yeah. -ish gameplay? Yep. I just want to see weird Yakuza-like stuff running around the streets. That's going to be trailer number five. Yep. But... A lot of ass. Lo <laughs> fans of ass will find a lot to love here. Ah. Great wind? Did she Inter lose her pants? Yeah, that's an interesting model. It looks like she just forgot them. Just have a little text pop up that says she's 18 and just ease all our hearts, please. <laughs> <laughs> one text. <sighs> There's no way. There's no way, Leo. I'm gonna guess. Yeah, they're going for 17. 17? 17? Yeah. I don't know. I want to say 16, but mm. the vibes feel 17. This is what you were like at 17, or? There's just a little more confidence. See, that's right. 17. Yep. Not quite 18 yet, though. Yo, that's So ooh. she will be 18 when it releases. 
Yep, the slipping up move, accidentally yep. attacking with that. We, you just took two years off her with that. And she has a hawk. <laughs> okay. Can you turn that hawk into pants? The one we're looking for. Kimmy. Kimmy. Regular Kimio, they call her. The horse just watches the fight in the background. Thank you, London. Thank you. It looked Don't like mind she was me. trying to escape her own skin there. Wouldn't you if you were in Cammy's body? <laughs> be she honest. was trying to pop out her own back. All these moves look awesome. Uh, you know, we're not yeah. we're not giving the animation it's due here. This these do look no, awesome. No, they all it looks great. Limited, not as many crotch shots on this one though. Right, right. Interesting, interesting decision mm -hmm. from the creative team. Awaits. That's what I was thinking too. I do like that the the fighting animations has leaned even more from five into like hanging on the hit and spending extra frames on it and yeah. making it feel really weighty that way. For sure. That's such a cool stylish look. Somebody's watched Sakurai's little YouTube videos that are all about that. I feel like he just keeps pumping those out of like, slow down your impacts, make every attack count. Oh, I actually haven't watched any Sakurai videos. Oh, really? Oh, they're really interesting. But I guess I'm as good as him. <laughs> oh, God. Like she did. John Bernthal. Temperance, child. That happened? I don't remember that. Not the no. elevator. Without further ado, the gallant knight protects the princess bear. Is it Salazar? Like Just new VO? I'll make it cheap for you. Move! I remember this part. Yes, yeah, sir, you just freaking played this game. Is the, dog, is the dog still gonna be in this? Uh, it, but you couldn't like save him, right? Every indication is that the dog is brutally murdered in front of him. <laughs> Been a long time, comrade. Here we go. I don't know. I hope that it still keeps its like goofy. You can't save anyone. I don't know, because it was kind of goofy. It I mean, it, I feel it felt like, a little goofy. It feels like it's showing more goofiness here than. I hate to say that this feels like a good horror game. Together. I hated that part. Thanks. Trying to snipe Where's to protect the man with like, the Gatling gun? Let us rescue the Princess Dulcinea. You gotta hurt yourself. Does he do? He live longer in this one? This is kind of oh hell yeah! Look, but like Lewis was that? Was I know he wasn't there for that. Oh really? He was dead for that. Interesting. He literally died like the third time you saw him. Right? Like he he's hanging around a lot longer. Like I told you. Giving us what we want. People are curious. Okay, they have a little R3 because people are curious about the quick time events in that Krauser fight. And it looks like they're kind of going to be there. But in less of a full cutscene. Yeah. This time, it has to be different. Hey, Sarah, this seems like a good game to take the deepest dive on. Uh, if I'm going to be so yeah, old. Wouldn't that be nice? Wouldn't that be nice? So I can finally talk about the prolonged Leon Luis bromance. That's right. March 24th, everybody! Oh, Special soon. demo! They're doing it! It's probably gonna be the village section. That's gonna be so exciting. Did you see the credit for Leon's jacket? No. It, said it appeared with permission from Shot NYC or Harley something Quinn. on the bottom. Wow. Oh, wow. King Shark That's and awesome. Captain Boomerang against the world's greatest DC superheroes in this extended Oh, look, mercenaries people are stoked Squad. about. What did, sorry, I missed that. It just said it Let's includes mercenaries? Is that what it said? Steady Studios. It said mercenaries. Quizzing us. Sorry. Hi, everyone. Yeah. My name is Dara Sedarian, and I'm the studio product director. I'm phoning it in today. <laughs> Suicide Squad. I don't Killed know which parts I'm supposed to memorize. Yeah. I don't remember 80% of this already. <laughs> it is a third person action shooter set five years after. This is how you get people pumped about Suicide Squad. Yes. Metropolis has been invaded, and you're going in as the Suicide Squad members Top Harley to Quinn, me. King Shark, Deadshot, and Captain Boomerang to face <laughs> this off. Is, this is such a backfire because I want to listen to him, but I'm too hyped up. I'm literally talking <laughs> over it. hard at work at creating the best possible game experience for our players, and we're very excited to share more as part of this. I'm going to make a game, and I'm going to create Today, the worst possible player experience. Today, a brief look at one of the missions in our game. <laughs> Fuck you guys. We could not have cared less about the player squad, experience. You'll need to work together in up to four-player online co-op to stop the Flash and rescue Lex Luthor in the process. Enjoy. 
Rescue Lex, come on. <laughs> yeah, no, thank you. Let's bust something up. I think we're all a little uh, less optimistic about this because of Gotham Knights. Um, oh, a little bit. Hold on a second. But there's a perfectly but... good Hello, chance that this Brainiac? is the amazing version of what that happening? was trying to be. It's a chance. Great. You will have Luther ASAP. Is this where he lost his finger? You want Luther? All you have he to seems do to have is him. come and get him. Christ-like. Because. I feel like that was a cop out. The what? No matter the cost. Uh, probably turn his face buns. Oh, just like the Princess Leia look? I feel like they just were like, I don't want to have to animate face nails. Oh, interesting. Mm. Alright. Imagine how cool that would look with pigtails. Yeah. Know. True. I don't think I'd want it. The, the hair should distract me. Like Aloy's hair, probably, I can like, never... The pigtail actually would get into the frame too much. Yeah. Oh, it seemed like she was swinging from points in the air, not from points on buildings or anything. Yeah, does not feel like a Spider-Man philosophy there. But it's right. DC. Um, they have really dense clouds in the DC universe. Focus on fire on this. <laughs> They're just <laughs> grappling onto flying superheroes that are passing. <laughs> I know it's more boring, but I kind of just wanted to focus just on one character. Like, just. I know you're trying to show off the co op thing. Nice aim. This person's killing me. Oh. This person's got good aim. That, that player's me. What I would be doing. POV <laughs> <laughs> me playing this game. Roger that, Quinn. Eyes up. We got more company. Boy, they gotta be so. so just, like, shoot anything purple. <laughs> Interesting, yeah. Senseless violence, love it. Hail that weak spot, squad. No worries. Boom! Job done. You came through, over. Just call me the pinball wizard. Ah. Uh, you're not going to be doing that? I don't. I'm not planning on it. If it comes up, it comes up. <laughs> She's just kind of like hovering with that. Yeah. She's just grabbing something in the air, like a drone or something. Oh! Yep. Oh, okay. It would look cooler with pink but... <laughs> Hopefully that's an outfit you can unlock. Right. You can have to pay for it. By which I mean pay money for it, yeah. <laughs> a lot of shooting. Again with, like, the shooting, shooting the purple thing. Yeah, really? I like the more just physical. Just putting it in front of you. The interesting attacks look cool, but I, mm -hmm. if it's a games of service with a lot of big things with a lot of big weak points, it might be more of a destiny. Uh, just shooting a lot of bullets for a long time. No, leave me in my shipping crate. He's learned the error of his ways, Harley. I was happy in there. <laughs> there needs to be one pile of poop in the corner just to make it more realistic. <laughs> <laughs> so, how the whole taking down the flash thing go? Oh, that was to get this guy out of a Come shipping crate? Way. That's right. I have work Lex Luthor. Show some respect. Well, hey there, sleepyhead. We've got an interrogation to get back to. Hey. That you didn't seem that I'm fast. You just gonna let you <laughs> walk away? And tell these guys everything you know? <laughs> you think they can stop us? Pathetic. 
Pathetic? At least I'm not a big hero turned stooge for a spaceman! <laughs> okay, Boomerang. You want to see? I thought he was just gonna say, "Okay, Boomerang." I thought so too. <laughs> I'll show you. Opposed to killing him because he was a good person once. I don't think they can kill him. They might be helping to heal. You him. have to kill us, Diana. That's what I'm saying. Oh. We have to die. Cool. To save the world. <laughs> that is cool. <laughs> and again, it's the Jeff and Creed. If if you do not actually kill them, Suicide game over. Uh, we're we're they uninstalled. They don't die on screen. They're not actually dead. Right. I want to see their heartbeat Rock stop. Rocksteady Studios has physically. more to share today. Let's listen in. Let's listen in. Put me in that Zoom meeting. <laughs> Show me what you got. <laughs> Silly. Suicide Squad killed the Justice League. Hey, he left. It's an extension of the Arkhamverse, and it's really about now reframing the story and telling it from the villain's That's weird, point isn't of it? View. Where are we going? And yeah. Who are we killing? It's a mixture of Big deal. lots of the yeah, things they are better. I hope the fans I stand like by that. But like a whole massive chunk of new stuff that they've never seen before. <laughs> We've always seen Batman's perspective on this world. And we thought it'd be really fun and enjoyable to see this universe, but like, through the eyes of the villains. We're picking up the story five years after the end of Arkham Knight, and a lot's changed in that time. Just checking. We're all seeing that thing, right? Brainiac has invaded Earth, and he's this huge threat overlooking Metropolis. I don't think I realized this was in the, the Arkham universe. City. Oh, yeah. The Justice League are there to try That's what's weird, because, like, Batman's in it. But Brainiac has captured and he's supposed to be dead, so it's a little confusing. Oh, fuck, it's Superman! <laughs> so the Justice League share the same goal as Brainiac to take over Earth and turn it into the new Kalu. What we've created is a classic Justice League, but with the sense that there's something wrong with them. They are now doing Brainiac's bidding. <laughs> I've gotten that sense. And Amanda Waller <laughs> scrambles to try to uh, Axel remedy this, Ridby. essentially save the Earth. And she recruits uh, four lovable characters into fighting the Justice League in an effort to reclaim the Earth and thwart Brainiac's Is this an exclusive plans. or something? Why are we hearing so much about it here? Uh, I am sure they just have like that light partnership with them and whatnot, but it's not an exclusive. Harley Quinn, Captain Boomerang, Deadshot, and King Shark. Harley Quinn is definitely the most acrobatic of, of the crew. She's always moving, she's always flying through the air in kind of barely controlled ways. The feeling of swinging and the momentum and the kind of physicality of it and, and trying to keep that momentum going and use that to go over buildings or swing under bridges and chain that into kind of sure. the, the grapple mechanic that she's got. It just feels spot on. I'm a freaking superstar. Deadshot has the iconic Deadshot look, but with a rocksteady twist. He's got <laughs> a real swagger to him. And in this game, he can also hover with his jetpack. He's super yeah, the precise. glowing he purple on the helicopter. I don't know. And they all fit with his well, this feels like a, a game that you like play with your friends, assassin. you turn your brain off, you, you shoot the purple orbs. Yeah. And you're like, what's happening? I don't know. King but we're having fun together. As, as a person is, well, as a fish is this incredible character who's super well read and super well to do and i'm sure could smash an operatic performance actually i'm the son of a god it is my shame to suffer mortals and their buffoonery but also doesn't really know simple words or simple things that are going on i think that's brilliant in terms of combat he is a brute he's a, a tank character he i wish i had a british ability to all lean into the it's not too late to get, you know, i wish you did too but but you have more like a mid-atlantic i think at this point Captain Boomerang's got his um, Speed Force gauntlet that he can use together with his boomerang. You ever been to that England, Sarah? Any point in space no. And speed force to that point along if you went walls, once, you could write it off the rest of your life and use that accent. You'd be totally you fine. Can use that. Get up close. I went there once. Dodge around in midair, okay. taking out there the enemies, go. and then scarper because he, he doesn't want to stick around. Don't worry, guys. 
I'm here. One of the most exciting parts that connects our game to the DC lore are the support squad. Here's all, widow. And you have Penguin, the arm stealer. Widow. You're making guns for us Is he now, still Nolan right? North, I wonder? But also some new faces. Hack, who is a digital ghost that is what? helping the squad both navigate the world but also upgrade their neck bombs. That's a big adrenaline spike. Upgrade your neck bombs? This. Toy to man, not kill you as much? That <laughs> seems like number one upgrade and the only upgrade I care about. <laughs> and then finally we have Gizmo, who is helping the squad with insane vehicle creations that let you blow shit up. Wait, you just drive around? Well, this is your playground. You're gonna get to meet It'd be cool if you could drive around different villains, with your bros. And you really get to see these cool, iconic locations. Being the city of tomorrow kind of like men. I like that it's Metropolis. Contrast with Gotham yeah. City, which is very dirty, it's always raining. And that contrast with like a city that's very grand, it's very clean. It's very functional. The huge difference between Metropolis and Gotham is that Metropolis really acknowledge and really trust Superman. So there is a lot of statues to thank Superman for everything he's done for the city. You're getting to see Metropolis <laughs> through the villains. Yeah. They really You're turned to experience on fast. This world and traverse through this world as the villains. Greetings, Metropolis! I want more so graffiti cool of like ability. local politicians and stuff around, around Minneapolis. Don't you want to see like a? That works with combat. Is I don't know graffiti of like the together. mayor. It's like you've abandoned us. I mean that kind of like direct stuff. I think is more. I feel like I have seen stuff like that. Really? You gotta point it out to me. You have it. Just drop a pin on Google Maps and I can go check it out. Weapons, your guns, your melee attacks, and how to use them all to your best advantage to control the chaos and come out victorious. What's awesome about gunplay is the variety. So there's six. This is longer than the entire patterns, previous part of the yeah. state of play. Sniper yeah. rifles, shotguns, miniguns, and pistols. It's to it's the, the point of like structurally, is it weird if they have a one more thing after this? I think it kind of is. There's um, yeah, I feel like weapons. it would be. Later on in the game, we also have gear sets. The gear sets are villain themed. For example, if you have a Bane gear set and you trigger his buffs in the game. Some of it will have the Bane drums, and you'll be like, Bane, and like, boom, 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 and then there's like green smoke, and you trigger all Sounds the good. Sample effects. Sample that. So you're basically taking the essence of the villain, you're bringing it into the game. Each character has a power level in the game. That I already know score. more about As this game than I ever really wanted to. <laughs> no going back. All yeah. against my will. Yeah. <laughs> As part so of it's like Apex, journey, but... Unlock more and more no, 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 no. More and more ways to customize your character to Ooh. really fit the way you Ooh, want plus four percent impact. Yes, is upgradable. So in <laughs> can I pre order and get that? Like you're gonna get lots of choice to use the weapons that you need and to complete your missions, but yeah. most importantly, I think you will be able to customize oh, that's your cool. squad. Oh, did it say battle pass on there? Somebody in chat. You can wear. Uh, well, there was that leak screenshot that showed the battle pass, and everybody lost it. Asylum jail outfit and still have like the best gear. That's kind of cool. I like it. Oh, you get to wear little Our costumes. game is a one to four player co-op experience, which means that all the missions in the game have been designed to support solo play, playing with a friend, two friends, or three friends. For the single player fans, you can play in single player with bots filling in the role of the squad, so okay. you still feel like you're part of a team. I never like Most having bots. We're yeah. King Shark now. Uh, or we can say, well, I think Harley will be a better fit for this mission. I'm gonna switch over and I'm gonna try her out. Okay, as long as you can switch. But if you okay. really want to tear it up, going in with so a it's full like group of four, it's exactly like Shrek right. The mayhem yeah. the Suicide Squad has to offer, and you get to really experience the dynamics between how you can all play together in different play styles in order. I think yeah. if this was more of a Shrek Two, I think that would have been. <laughs> I mean, it, it's like a Shrek 2 kind of for beginners. The story's done. Right. Mm -hmm. I think mm -hmm. It's like a lower uh, you know, investment in investment track too. The game after it's launched. We're going to deliver lots of new content to our players. We're going to have new playable characters, new weapons. New playable new characters. For players who like to customize their looks, we'll offer a battle pass that only contains cosmetic items. Are they going to like eventually so just open it up to like a enjoy. battle royale? Just like they're just going to sneak it in there? I would be the shocked. Because I can't like imagine putting so much cosmetics like into RPG it for a game that you can only play with like three other people. Well, welcome to the state of the game industry right now, Sarah. It don't make much sense. It's confusing. It's kind of has it all. It's very fast paced. It's really colorful. It's loud and unapologetic and in your face. And it's going to be really, really fun. And it's in your face. Do you like live execution? Well, don't touch that dial, or I'll break your fingers. Is that, is that foreshadowing because they take his finger off? Let's say yes. Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League that... arrives on PS5 what? later this year. Is that it? We'll be back with more announcements soon. Thanks for watching. Soon meaning like E3 time? All right.
Okay. Easy internet. Easy. Don't be mad. We didn't make it. We didn't make it. Everyone be cool. Uh, okay, how's everybody feeling about the Suicide Squad there? Uh, sure, was that announced? Did we know this was a Suicide Squad state of play? Yeah, yeah. They, they To be fair to them, to Big Sony, they were pushing it pretty clearly. Of like, this is a lot. This is a lot about Suicide Squad. Okay, now what do you make yeah. of this? Are they just desperate to show? It must be. That looks like terrible UI I in the middle. That's co-op. Too many maps on opposite sides? For sure, that's split-screen co-op. That's going to be so much fun. That's, That's great. Wild. I, they're getting so many more people in the door by having that closer camera angle option. Right. Yeah, I really think so. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, I went to their GDC talk last year and it was just a lot of them talking about how brutally difficult it was. <laughs> and it's like, I don't know if we can ever finish this game. So yeah. it's amazing it's coming out. Um, it really yeah. seems like, yeah, it really seems like it'd be really hard to. Yeah, even when I played it like two years ago, I was like, yeah. oh. And, and there's like, it, they're always so long. These games always just go and go and go and, and go. Right, and right. they're like, how much more did they make up? Uh, yeah, overall, pretty weak state of play, but by God, we'll be talking about it on the new episode of the MinMax Show podcast. <laughs> if you're on YouTube right now, yes. that'll be starting uh, very soon, live on YouTube, then it'll be up in your podcast feed shortly after that. So if you're watching this, you can always subscribe to MinMax's YouTube channel. We'd appreciate that. Or you can subscribe to the MinMax Show podcast. It's not a Patreon exclusive. It's right there waiting for you. And then we're going to be joined by Kyle Hilliard to unpack all this. And if you thought we were insightful, once you hear Kyle share his thoughts on this, it's poetry. It's the only way you can describe it is it's absolute ancient poetry, the way that man speaks. Uh, all right, Sarah, any final thoughts before we close the sucker out? No thoughts. No thoughts. No thoughts. Uh, I'm going to go stare at a wall for a bit. That makes sense. Uh, please uh, help support independent games media and join the deepest dive on Like a Dragon Eshin with this crew. It'll be a very fun time. I feel like that game is already kind of getting lost in the shuffle, but it's good and there's a lot of stuff to unpack in it so help give that game the discussion it deserves by supporting us on patreon and enjoying the conversation we'll share your comments in the discussion also you can unlock the podcast version of that huge discussion that kicks off next week if there's right. ever been a game with a ton of weird little side stuff to dig into it's that series that's it all right thanks so much everybody we appreciate it goodbye